Hello and welcome to a Factorio tutorial. Today I will show you how to create this clock. So, firstly, what is this clock or what is this clock showing exactly? This is the time this safe exists. So, let me show how accurate it is uh, by no, not loading, saving the game. Yeah. So, I save the game. It's uh and load the game and we see 10 hours 41 minutes 20 seconds 10 hours 41 minutes 70 seconds uh, I've I have not synchronized it so perfectly but I guess with the con uh, three seconds are okay okay so how does it work basically this panel works with uh, this column for each number this column searches for heavy oil and what yeah what uh, kind it is or how many heavy oil there is and it looks for a oh, heavy oil uh, 9 and when it is it outputs signal 0 and it uh, looks into this console combinator, combinator and uh, sets on these LEDs on these signals and also the color so this is and basically for every number so this is how the panel works but how does the timing work so basically the timing worked by a little trick the game runs on 60 ticks per second so if we build a, a small contraption that makes us a tick generator then we have um, the example so for example uh, signal M and made it to more one one hundred one thousand and output the same amount that is incoming so we take the output signal and loop it back into the input signal so if there is one and it's of course uh, not so big than one thousand it's get run and then another one comes comes again and uh, then it's going up and up and up and up and up until they reach 1000 and then resets itself so we have to set here an output of m, m and we see it starts counting input signal output signal on oh, and yeah um and when it hits 1000 we will see it resets itself there okay so this is basically the timing on 60 uh 60 ticks per second it's 600 divided by 60 so i've got a constant number 8 9 0 1 2 okay so this basically this contraption basically controls the seconds of the display so it runs through here up to here see and it displays it here so let it let us see it changing okay and uh, so how does the 10 10 seconds and the minutes and the 10 minutes and the hours and so on work so basically i've got many chests here and um first it depends on your bonuses so if you've got bonus two like i have so inserter takes three stacks, uh, three items per grab, a normal, normal inserter, and so I've I have to multiply six by three, and that's the basic system. It takes every uh, every it looks for uh, it looks for the cons uh, the si if signal one it's is nine, and then it takes three items and put it in the another chest. And if this chest got 18, like in some seconds, it gets emptied by those stack inserters. And if this is 18, then the uh, arithmetic combinator is divided in by 3, or every number that's in, uh, inside is divided by 3, and got an output signal of 2. So that's the second number. And if this chest has 18 chests in it, wooden chests in it, this inserter grabs three items in the next thing. But this is a 
10. Uh, those uh, this is only uh, have to count up to six. This is to count up to ten, and um, so inside here are thirty. Again, ten times three, and this is uh, yeah. So this is the same thing basically with thirty. Here are more stack inserters because um, this box has to be emptied in one grab. So there, that's because there are uh, three of them. Okay, and then it runs from here, from this chest to there, to the ten minutes, and so on, until you've got nine hundred ninety-nine hours. You can, of course, you can uh, expand it if you want, but you don't have to. I guess 999 hours are a bit much for a factory save. The whole game, maybe not, but uh, one save, okay. So when you get the blue uh, blueprint string that is in the description, you have to set up your own time, of course. And this is uh, here's how it works. So you've got the hours, the uh, the Last one is here, second one is here, this is there, so on it's so it's mirrored, so you have to look out for it. Uh, firstly, I would uh, turn this off so the whole clock stops, and uh, you can set up your time you've got on your save. And um, yeah, basically multiply it with uh, three when you've got the bonus of. Two, you multiply it by three, only one, it's multiplied by two, and uh, no bonus is just ten, 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 six, ten, six. So if you want to build it earlier, there are two things you have to change. First, this, divided by the uh, amount an inserter takes. So this, uh, for me, it's three, for you, it's maybe two or one. And you have to change this, uh, these inserters that are connected with the green wire because they have they look for the item count inside this and the item count inside this aren't 18 anymore, they are only 12 or 6. On this side 30, 20 or 10. And here as well. So. I've made it for the end game that it's uh, countable for the end game. And yeah, the blueprint swing is again in the description. I've made a more compact version here. It's the, at least this is more compact. And uh yeah. Let Yeah, you can write something in the comments how you like it and uh I haven't found a video explaining how that works. I have found a video uh, where they show it but uh, this is a video how I ex explain it or, or I explain it my way and this is uh, my contraption yeah hope you liked it um, I'm 89 coolman and maybe we will see you in the next video